Bo, okay, so I'm chilling at my cousin's house, right? Nothing unusual. We're sitting in his room, probably playing some Xbox. Pro- I don't know what we're doing, honestly, but we're probably playing Xbox or, I don't know, hitting each other. And we're, you know, we're just chilling, right? Having a good time. My uncle walks in the room and he says, hey, can y'all help me for a second? So we both know this isn't going to be a second. We're going to be helping him for the next about five hours. And he's going to scream at us and he's probably going to throw stuff. And it's just not going to be a good next five hours, right? And we're like, yeah, sure. And I'm thinking we're going to help him like move something. No, we walk into the garage. He has his truck, the hood open, the engine exposed. There's about 4,000 engine parts just laying in the garage. He's like, we need to fix, I don't know what it was. We need to fix something with the engine, right? And we're like, okay. And uh, one small problem, me and my cousin don't know nothing about cars, especially about this dude's truck from like the 1920s. And my uncle knows literally nothing about trucks. I mean, he knows, Here, this is what my uncle knows about trucks. That he likes how they look, and that's about it. That's all he knows. So none of us know how to fix this stupid engine. And while he won't take it to a mechanic because my uncle's too cheap. So we're like trying to figure, he's trying to fix his own engine while me and my cousin just stand there getting screamed at, right? So we're just like sitting there taking the abuse. And eventually my uncle's just, he's just mad. He's like, can one of y'all grab me the screwdriver? And we're like, yeah, sure. So we, my cousin turns around to go grab the screwdriver. I'm like, there's a screwdriver like by your foot. He's like, that's the wrong screwdriver. My cousin walks over with the exact same screwdriver, right? Same size, same everything. And my uncle's like, this is the wrong screwdriver. My cousin's like, well, you didn't tell me which one to grab. This dude chucks the screwdriver into the wall of the garage, and it goes through the wall and goes inside. So now my uncle's mad that, one, he got the wrong screwdriver, and two, that he just put a hole in the wall. My aunt's mad because, you know, that just flew through the wall. So now my uncle's super mad. And we spend the next, like, three hours trying to fix this engine. Again, none of us know how to do that. So he, like, keeps turning the car on. And it keeps not starting. So at, after, like, at the end, we have about the entire engine out of the truck. And so we're just standing there. We don't know how to rebuild an engine. So my uncle just starts throwing stuff back into where he thinks it belongs. And, um, yeah, the truck never started again. He had to get it towed to a uh, mechanic shop. And, yeah, it cost him way more money than it would have if he would have just, you know, brought it to him in the first place. But So my uncle gets mad, right, because the truck is, like, basically useless. So he just sells it. He just sells it to the mechanic and buys a new truck. And, uh, yeah, he was super mad at us because he's like, why didn't y'all help me fix the engine? And, again, we were, like, 10, by the way. So we don't know how to fix an engine. Actually, we might have been, like, 11. But it doesn't matter. Neither of us know how to fix an engine. And, um, yeah, that's pretty much it.